How's it going guys? It's Trey Bear from TreyBear.com here and in this video I want to give you guys a beautiful analogy that's going to help you understand the power of consistency and how that's going to pay off for you in your network marketing business. Let's get started. In network marketing, in MLM, you probably heard me talk about before the power of consistency and how that pays off. And it took me, guys, it took me two years to really understand how that will pay off for me if I'm just consistent. If I get enough people to just be consistent with me, how that's gonna pay off in my network marketing business, okay? So here's the analogy. Let's say, you know, we're out in my front yard, okay? I've got a couple, three, four acres of land in my front yard. And in those acres, it's just filled with rocks and rocks and just all types of rocks. I mean, some rocks are in puddles, some rocks are in dog shit because my, you know, I, don't, I just mow over dog poop. I don't pick it up. The, the whole land is just filled with hundreds and thousands. I mean, thousands and thousands, just 100,000 rocks, okay? The idea is to go out there and flip over a rock, see what it says. Now, the one you're looking for is the one that says you're going to make $25,000 for the rest of your life every single week. Now that rocks out there and it's up to you to go find it. You're not going to have any tools. You're not going to have a shovel. You know, you're not going to have this big bulldozer or anything like that because that's cheating. You have to actually go out there and put in the work. So what do most network marketers do? They go out there and they start talking to people, right? They're flipping over the rocks saying, hey, are you open to checking this thing out? I'm doing this new business. You open to make some extra income? Now most people are going to tell you no, right? Not everyone's says yes, but most people say no. Most people ignore you. Most people will say, sounds like a pyramid scheme, right? Sounds like a scam. Oh, I don't have time for that. Oh, my friend tried one of those once and it didn't work. So you get the idea that the rocks are people that you're talking to. They're prospects. Now, as people do say yes, I am open. Now you have more people who are going to be picking up rocks with you. So you got you and Sally, you got you and Joe over here. You guys are now all picking up rocks. Now, Joe over here, he's kind of a pansy ass and I'm telling you, you know, he's going to pick over 10, 20, 30 rocks. He's going to flip them over. He's like, guys, my back's aching. I just, you know, I can't do it anymore. Too many rocks are telling me no. My mom told me to stop going after my dreams of $25,000 every week in my business. I could spend my time more wisely than flipping over rocks. So Joe quits, he stops, or he finds some other shiny object that he wants to go pick up because he thinks that it'll be easier for him to go pick up those rocks. Those are sedimentary rocks not metamorphic rocks. So Joe goes over there and he starts to see if that's easier for him, but it's the act of flipping over these rocks that is gonna lead you to that 25K a week. It's just up to you to be consistent. Go out there today, flip over 10. Flip over 20 if you want, but don't go out there and flip over 100 and say it didn't work. Make a decision today that you are gonna get your name on that board, right? You're gonna put a number in the box. You're gonna go out there and you're gonna ask people if they're open to making some extra income. You're gonna ask them if they're open to a side project if it didn't interfere with what they're currently doing. Be consistent and I'm telling you, you will start to see that money coming pouring in in your network marketing business. I love you guys. Peace.